Hi, I'm Don Badan from SampleLibraryReview.com. Today, we're going to be checking out RX-11 by Isotope. Isotope RX-11 has long been a standard toolkit for professionals for a full suite of audio restoration, cleaning, and manipulation. I have to say, playing around with this update, some of the features here are almost magic. The improvements and new features and new modules will be welcome to both professionals who've been relying on RX for years, as well as those just getting started with audio cleaning, repair, and optimization. The big updates here for RX11 are enhanced machine learning capabilities, there's new algorithms, and new modules. Now, I'm going to try out a bunch of the new modules and features and share how I've been using RX11, both with dialogue and for music. Uh, let's first dive into the new dialogue isolate module. It's incredible to watch this team work together to get the balloon up in the air. It's incredible to watch this team work together to get the balloon up in the air. It gives you precise control for voice, reverb, and noise. It's incredible to watch this team work together to get the balloon up in the air. And the advanced version does come with extra parameters to dial in more control. It's incredible to watch this team work together to get the balloon up in the air. Just to get a feel for what this thing can do, I cranked up just the noise and muted both the voice and the reverb. It's... My favorite new feature of RX-11 is the repair assistant. My biggest takeaway is not only did the 30 days fly by, but I did feel less stressed and less anxious within a week or so. It uses machine learning to craft a custom signal chain to try to clean your audio up the best it can. This makes the whole process faster and pretty easier. I found I got some pretty good results with it. I guess my biggest takeaway is not only did the 30 days fly by, but I did feel less stressed and less anxious within a week or so. If you're regularly dealing with a ton of audio problems in dialogue like I do in my vlog, this could really help you clean up that sound and get better audio for your video. I guess my biggest takeaway is not only did the 30 days fly by, but I did feel less stressed and less anxious within a week or so. With vlogging audio, I found I got even better results combining multiple modules. So many trees where we're camping this week that I had to bring my Starlink out here to this field. Using the voice denoise. So many trees where we're camping this week that I had to bring my Starlink out here to this field. So many trees where we're camping this week. So many trees where we're camping this week that I had to bring my Starlink out here to this field. And the D wind module, which is worth its weight in gold. Field, field, out here to this field. So many trees where we're camping this week that I had to bring my Starlink out here to this field. So many trees where we're camping this week that I had to bring my Starlink out here to this field. Now they did a neural network update for their music rebalance module. Letting you separate out voice. Has the sun in? Bass. drums and an other slider Now, as I'm sure you hear as well, there's a lot of artifacts and this isn't the cleanest stem separation, but I do think this will be most useful for those doing post-production, don't have access to an instrumental and need to pull that vocal down just to get it out of the way of dialogue. The 
continuing with the music tools, the loudness module is going to be really handy. This allows you to bring your lowest levels up to try to get maximum loudness out of your track. Light, blue beauty, mystic to me, cast through the trees, move in the sea. In my workflow, I often get it to a nice level, make sure it's normalized for maximum for CD headroom. And then with the new streaming module, you're able to hear what it's going to sound like on different streaming platforms so you don't get a big surprise once you've uploaded your music. Cast through the trees, move in the sea. The Another tool I found that I'm using quite often with RX11 is the EQ match. This EQ module just works so quickly and easily. For instance, if I have a really nice guitar. But I want to give it more of a sound like this. and instantly it'll capture that EQ and I can apply it to my original track. One thing they did talk about in their official videos with the dialogue contour module. I played around with it a little bit, but as you can hear, even in the official examples, it's just the slight variations that it's really giving to your dialogue. Time in queue is four hours. Your time in queue is four hours. New to RX11 is the mid side module, letting you visualize and manipulate both the center channel as well as your side channels. First we can go outside, down alternative road. First we can go outside, down alternative road. Now, if you're not familiar with the suite, the modules include de-hum, spectral de-noise, de-click, de-rustle, de-wind, and de-clip. Asking price for RX11 Advanced is normally $1,199, which is a pretty hefty tag. They do have a current special going on. You can get it for $7.99 during their intro price, which is still a pretty serious purchase price for indie creators. RX11 Advanced is a beast. It can be a little daunting to learn and master multiple modules, although those who have been using the software for years will have no problem adjusting to the new modules in 11, since you're already familiar with the basic ideas and concepts between their workflow. Now, the Spectral Editor in particular could have a pretty steep learning clutter for beginners, and although the Repair Assistant does make jumping in to clean up audio fairly easy for noobs, jumping to the entire suite could seem a little daunting. And it's going to take some time and practice to get used to all the different features of the different modules. RX11 Advanced is pretty powerful. The enhanced machine learning algorithms, new features like the streaming preview, loudness optimizer, and upgraded modules like the Music Rebalance and Spectral Editor make it a top pick for audio professionals. The suite is complete with the standouts being that new Dialogue Isolate module, which works almost like magic. And I say almost because although the dialogue separation from reverb and noise are great, they're just shy of the magic I've heard in some dedicated AI cloud-based tools that are specifically dedicated to just clean up dialogue. For those who can leverage its full potential, RX11 Advanced offers an unmatched suite of audio repair, and those who've been using RX for years will find the new advancements in 11 welcome features to optimize your workflow for the professionals. Now, I'd love to hear your thoughts below. Please comment below. Let me know if you've been using Isotopes RX for your audio cleaning, for your music work, for dialogue or post-production. Please comment below. If you haven't already, please like the video, subscribe to the channel, and head back around on Fridays for our weekly deal compressor show.